Andy G. It's a tough, uh, tough tour, isn't it? Yeah, uh, quite harder than I expected it to be. I think it's even harder than it, it was the, the years before. But you know, it's a world tour race now. But yeah, today in today's cycling, there's no more easy races. Every race is, is just bloody hard. Sort of. You need the conditioning, though, don't you? So it's a it's a good uh, good conditioning to set you up for the for, for the European tour. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, that's the main goal why I'm here. I'm, I'm looking to get race kilometers in my legs. And um, since the first day, I'm second day was still okay, but third day I was suffering, and I'm suffering every day. And um, today I felt a little bit better in the end, but still, you know, I got to keep it um, quiet because it's uh, it's a long season. Well, Andy Oz is about 300 meters from the finish on the first KOM, and um, you were you were there down at the tail of the peloton, but I can tell with the field and. I, the roar was as loud as I heard it, so you've got a lot of supporters here in Australia. Yes, I'm really glad for that, and that's one of the main reasons why I want to come back next year. Yeah, fantastic. Any prediction um, for yourself? Uh, what, what, what do you got lined up for the rest of the season? Uh, the goal is to win races. Um, I know that I still probably need a few races to come back in the rhythm and be competitive again uh, in, in the front, but I have no doubt that I'll be back uh, and strong. Andy, time for some good Australian wine, OK? Yes. Thank you. Thank you.